Many people in the religious community, they are really shaken tonight as well after learning one of their own was a victim in yesterday's senseless tragedy. Deacon Hayward Patterson was active in the church and the community. WKYC's Emma Henderson has more tonight on the man known to many simply as Tenny. God, that you would heal, God, yes, that we give yes, your glory. Yes, yes. From spiritual leaders to neighbors, being close to Tops on Jefferson has been a step in grasping the hate Buffalo's black community experienced Saturday. It hurts. It angers me. It upsets me. But I'm not going to let like, that anger and upset turn into hate and violence. That's not going to be the solve the problem. While Michael Ray didn't know anyone killed, this is his store. It's the place that his family shops. <laughs> While Leonard Lane is grieving for his friend Hayward Patterson. He loved one another. He loved his children. He man can see. And he loved God. That's all he wanted to do is just help people. While speaking with us, Lane's friends came by to console. You wonder why people are feeling the way they are. They are hurt. They are broken. They snatched something that we worked so hard to get. Hurtful to me. Making the pain many living near Jefferson and Laurel are feeling clear. How are people in this community going to be able to go back to that top? This is the first thing they're going to think of now. I call this personally not a mass shooting, but a terrorist attack. It went at the psyche, it went at the spirit, and it went at the mentality that you are not safe anywhere. 